Okay, all done now. All the wires. There's the positive. That one goes off to the bus bars, the circuit breakers. So basically, we've got one battery, two batteries, loop to three, and four, and then there's your neutral going off. And there's your positive goes to your next one. So basically, those four batteries are now one battery cell, so that makes one battery. And then we've got them all over. And I've just thrown this, this switch in here for safety. It's kind of got the knob missing, but I figured it'd be safe just in case I have a problem. So I reckon that we should head out and uh, try the inverter. So we're in the shed. We're running on that inverter. This one's off. Let's go to the switch. Turn that on. Let's see. The first time I ever fire it up, guys. Now, which one's con constantly on? That way. Oh, all the lights are lighting up. Fans are kicked in. Can't really see the display very well. So basically... Oh, 50 hertz. All right. Let's just go over and turn the lights on to grid power, and then we'll go up here and turn off the power. So basically, as you can see, everything outside the shed's got dark. I'm, I'm glad the missus is sleeping. All right. Flick this changeover switch. And we'll just, I guess we'll wait a few seconds for the fridges if they're running. All right, we'll turn it up. Oh, look. We're uh, now running on the new inverter. Uh -huh. So I'm going to grab a chair and be right back. Just under 20 amps. And uh, I wonder how this display works. <laughs> I just can't even see that with this camera, eh? That's just a big blur. So there you are. That's the new inverter from um, Aussie Batteries. It just doesn't have um, an AC charge control I have found yet. But um, we're, we're running it now. Let's see if we can There we go. If I hold it on the side, you guys can see. Oh look, it's even got a temperature. Let's not try to hold the camera so I'm not wobbling it. Temperature, battery capacity says 75%. Input, so no grid power. It's obviously running it. I'm not going to get close enough to see it. It says it's running at 72% load. So So just in case, it must be a 6 kilowatt. Because what's it saying? We're flickering between 60 and 70 percent load, or 72. Uh, and the air gauge is about 12 amps, maybe 13. Hello everyone on YouTube land. I'll try to get this on here again. So yeah, it seems to be running uh, on uh, the batteries at 48 volts. Cool. All right. Um, Maisie out, and uh, I'll keep you guys on YouTube land updated. Right back.